so when we are uh, dissecting from below so we follow the margin of the sphincter complex that is the external sphincter complex in direction of coccyx posteriorly and then dissection proceed through the endococcygeal ligament and distal volvulus fascia into the pelvis Ischioinal dissection we have already covered uh, before also. So it is a one variant of elape when the uh, tumor is perforating or fissurizing or there is abscess formation into ischioinal uh, fossa. So we take out the whole pad of fat. So there are two pictures here. On the right side is the ischioinal dissection and the left side is the elape. So in the elape we are coming along the uh, outer surface of the levators and the external sphincter. But in case of ischioinal dissection we are taking out this whole fat and uh, I mean this is the, will be the largest defect which will be there in perineum and uh, there will be a requirement of closure without some kind of prosthesis so if uh, the other possibility is like you can do elapia on one side and the ischioinal dissection on one side if it is involving only on the one side to reduce the defect size